Anjali Kapoor from Oversight Global here again. And I today I want to talk about is leadership development for everyone. So I've been asked this question a few times, several times actually over the years. And my astounding reply is always yes. Now, I know what people are thinking when they ask this question. The real core of this question is, is everyone able to lead? And yes, absolutely. Everyone possesses the qualities to be able to lead. Therefore, those qualities can be learned and developed in order to be utilized in life each and every day in both your personal and professional life. So in my experience, people view leadership as authority figures, people who have power. Now, most of us may have grown up with the idea that those who are meant to lead are born with the skills and talents to be able to do so. Some might even think that if there are too many of us leading, there won't be enough of those um be enough of us to follow. So let's explore these concepts. So leaders as authority figures. Now, one type of leader is a leader um, is a leader in a leadership role or in a position of power. Now, this is how most people define a leader. While a title may give authority, leaders must also possess the necessary skills to establish and maintain order in order to motivate, engage, and inspire. Now, a true leader is... Um, somebody who is able to empower and influence others to become accountable, to contribute, and to see and work toward a bigger vision. Now, when we look at the corporate world, cor uh, companies tend to hire people for supervisory and managerial roles based on their tenure and their success in previous positions, which may not have included leading others. Now, a recent study by uh, careerbuilder.com indicated that a telling 58% of managers stated that they did not receive any type of leadership training when they were hired or promoted to their leadership positions. And natural born leaders. Now, people also tend to have the idea that leaders are born with the skills and talents to lead. Therefore, um, and there is some truth to that, yes, but there are some people who just have this as a strength and are comfortable being able to do this in a variety of situations. Now, for others, they find their leader emerges during certain situations, usually when they find something they are passionate about, they find their strength as a leader. Now, everyone is able to be the leader of their own lives, to be able to lead when it comes to their goals and desires. Everyone has something they are passionate about. Everyone is able to influence and inspire. Now, with the proper tools and techniques, everyone can develop their leader within them. If there are so many leaders who will follow. Now, I've heard people say, if there are so many leaders in the world, who's going to follow? Now, we all do not lead the same way, and we each have different um, something different to share, give, and say. We, chat, we each have our own strengths in our own areas, and we influence, empower, and inspire in our own ways. Essentially, we are all leading as well as following in this beautiful industry of influence. Is leadership development for everyone? So as you can see, there are different types of leaders. As mentioned before, everyone has the qualities of a leader and are capable of enhancing and developing their leadership skills according to their needs and desires to use their skills in their life each and every day. So are you ready to find your emerging leader or develop your leadership skills? So I hope that you've enjoyed this video and have found it helpful. Please be sure to like, comment, and share below as well as subscribe so that you get notified of future videos and series episodes on our channel. Until next time, I'll see you um, in the next video and take care.